Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to record your screen without downloading anything. Today we're just looking at configuring that, um, configuring that, uh, screen recorder, the screen recorder. We're configuring the screen recorder. I'm not going to show how to use it yet. We're going to go through that next episode of this. So, to set that up, you need to go to your start button. You need to go to set settings. You need to click on gaming. And go to Xbox Game Bar. And Xbox Game Bar con controls how your how Xbox Game Bar opens and rec recognizes your game. Enable Xbox Game Bar for things like recording game clips, chatting with friends, and receiving game invites. Some games require Xbox Game Bar for receiving game invites. If you have an Xbox controller, you can check this off to open the Xbox Game Bar using the Xbox button. I'll just, I don't, I'll have the controller, so I'll just, uh, keep that off. The keyboard shortcuts for Xbox Game Bar is, to open Xbox Game Bar, you need to press the Windows key and G. To take a screenshot, you need to press the Windows key, Alt, and print screen. To record what you just did, to record that or record the last 30 seconds of your game, Windows, Alt, and G. And to start slash stop recording, you need to press Windows plus Alt plus R. Microphone on or off while you're recording, you need to press Windows, Alt, and M. Start or pause broadcast, you need to press Windows, Alt, and B. And show camera and broadcast Windows, Alt, and W. You can click this to learn more about Xbox Game Bar. Now, to adjust your capture settings, you need to click the start button again. You need to go to your apps. Scroll over to Xbox Console Companion. Go to your settings. Go to captures. Go to Windows settings to adjust your capture settings. You need to press Windows settings. Press yes. Now, Xbox Console Companion will open the capture settings in settings. Captures, control how you capture your game through screenshots and game clips. You can click this to learn more about captures. Save screenshots and game clips and see users captures. This just tells you and you can click this to open your folder. This is the folder. It looks like this. Tap any of the videos to view it, and click this to learn how to save to a different folder. Background recording. Capture your previous plays by recording your game in the background. You can turn this on, and this may impact the quality of your game, and you can change this. The 30 seconds is recommended, but since it impacts the quality of your game, you can have this off. Recorded audio. Change how your game and microphone are recorded. Record audio when I record a game. Turn this on if you're making a YouTube video using the game bar or something. And turn mic on by default when you record, just in case. And put your microphone volume. You can adjust it by dragging this. And I'll just leave it to 100 so that you guys can hear my voice. Make sure you check this off or else if any notifications or mail comes, you don't hear the sound of the or the notification sounds. To adjust your recorded video, higher quality video may cap capture may impact the quality of your game. That's okay because that, that doesn't happen often and it's okay. So, video frame rate. When you start off the Xbox Game Bar, it's going to be on 30 FPS in standard. Standard is up to 144p to 720p. And just click 60 FPS to record at 720p and 60 FPS. Click high to record at 1080p and 60 FPS. Click 30 FPS to record at 1080p and 30 FPS. But I like 60 FPS better. Click this to capture this mouse cursor and check it off. Here's game mode, have this on so that it optimizes your PC for play. Xbox networking 
you can check how your networking is good and as you can see it's going to be performance and stuff my latency is 93 ms which is good packet loss is zero percent which is also good nat type is open server connectivity connected if it's not connected or if it's low packet loss is more tap fix it or check again so that's how you configure the game bar and you uh, record your screen without installing anything from your google chrome browser or the microsoft store Alright, bye bye, thank you for watching, I hope you enjoy, also subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for more notifications, please, it means a lot to me, make sure you thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, and also comment down below if you need more information, and bye.